Alright, here's full Pixel Ages in one video. A couple of these um, UR cases are just the same UPerm. So, UR to UB, just U, that. Or what you can do is this. Or what you can do is R to U and just do an S thing. It's probably faster. And for this one, there's not really an alternate, just UF to UL, just that U perm. All right, now for like the L face. So for here to um, this sticker, uh, the interchange is like an S move. So you just do that and then insert like that. For this one, the interchange is on U. So you just do a U move, insert like that, undo. For down here, you do a U to bring this here and then insert like that. Or you can do it down. I don't know how I did that wrong there. Oh well, like that. And then this is pretty similar to the second one, just back here, just that. And then the insertion is instead like that. This case for here is a one move set up to this case. And you can do the U move at the same time as the E move, so it goes like that. Down here, you do a four move insertion that goes um, like these moves. And since the M prime comes first, you do this. Uh, here to here to here is a pure com. You just do U prime and insert with R E to R prime. Here to here, um, it's pretty similar to the one for here. Just uh, do a U and then insert three moves like that. Uh, this one, the um, best way to do it is U prime and then inserting three moves like this. But if you prefer it, you can do a similar thing like that. And then this again, similar nine mover. Just put that there, insert. U2 at the end. Alright, so here to here. Um, you can do another four move insert like this, and again, it's going to cancel with the first one, so you do. Yeah. Uh, here to here to here. It's another pure com, just U prime. Insert with R prime, E2, R. So yeah, pretty, pretty easy there. Um, here to here, I think it's best to just do U, M, U, M twice. Here, you're going to do an E setup to this one, but since the first moves are U prime, you just do a U wide at the beginning, and then finish the com, and then just an E prime at the end. Now, a couple of good ways to do this, the way I do it is just... Um, this eight mover here to here. But another thing you can do is you can do a U R prime. And, uh, the R prime doesn't do anything, it just makes it more finger tricky. And then you do F, insert like that, F2, undo F. So it's whatever you prefer. I prefer the 8 move one. Here to here, um, you do this back insert like that to set up a 4 mover, but it cancels into it. So you go like that. For this one, you just do sexy move, it sets up a 4 mover, cancel at the end like that. Shit. And then if you go to here, you can do just do R U R prime into this S thing. But if you don't like that, you can just do D into this case or something. Alright, I messed that up slightly. Oh well, let's let's show you the first set then. Okay, so I've done the first set. Um, I'm gonna remove one every time just because the next one I'm doing is here. So the first alg I showed you was that, and this alg is just the inverse of that, and that goes for the majority of the comms. You can go find another one if you want, but I'd recommend just learning inverses, so there you have it. 
one's going to be removed every time and that happens to be it for this one so starting off here to here you you can easy for this one uh, to here you do a u prime and then an m and it sets up to a five mover so you go like this pretty easy here to here is a nine mover u prime insert u2 undo insert u prime that goes for the next three very similar ways to the first ones here to here you do r u prime and it says a four mover it's a very fast alg here uh, it's a bit more complicated you do you do a u prime m and it sets up this five mover in the back uh, i just think of it an alg at this point so you just do If you can't remember it, just this on my sheet. And then to here, just the mirror of the first one I showed you there. To here is the mirror of this one. So it goes. So it goes. To here. It's a nine mover again. And the rest of these face are just those kinds of nine movers you should really be able to figure these out pretty easily so here you do just l u prime like that for here i like to set up like this so there's still the u2 interchange so it's a d setup so this is here but you can do these at the same time sorry mess up a bit Yeah, and then this mirror, the first one I showed you there. Oops. I don't really think these need much explanation. Here to here, four mover. Here to here, one move set up to a four mover. Here to here, four mover. And here to here, set up to a four mover. So for this sticker, now we know these two from inverses. So we're actually starting here. Uh, you can look at this one, it's just a U prime set up to one of the case I showed before. So just, just U prime and so U prime. These are all basically gonna be mirrors of the last set as a warning, or well, the first set. One here. So, seeing the first set, these should be fairly intuitive. This is the exact mirror of one of the ones I showed you. In fact, all three of these are. These are also mirrors, but I'll just show them here to here. Here to here. Um, you can do this. Or if you don't like that, you can do R prime into the last one here. It's a pretty easy one. And then this again, you can do this pretty easy. Or if you don't like that, you can actually do mm, but I think that's slower. Right back here, you could do this, but I think it's awkward. I prefer to do U prime into um, just this case, so it's just so good. Here, I don't actually use the mirror of an alg. I do an M, and there's this interchange, so you do like this, and then cancel these at the end. Here, this is the mirror because it's just an 8 move MU. And then here, again, it's just a mirror of one of the other ones.
I mean, I personally use mirrors for all of these as well. So that's the 8 move R wide thing, which you can use the R prime F thing for. But I'll show that quickly. So here it's easier, actually. You could do. Sorry. Like that. Yeah. Three moves. Like that. I quite think I think that's the fastest way to do it. Yeah, just lefty sexy move, insert in the back, that's at the end. And this one just simple mirror of the old cases. So for this sticker, three inverses, we know these two pieces. So we're gonna go straight onto that. Right, so here to here, just an S move into this case into this case so it goes and then for this case I actually prefer to just rotate and do U2 and insert oh, yes. yeah. and then this is like just another S setup to easy comp so here to here you could do like for example R would work or um, another thing you do is M prime either work uh, just some examples uh, here to here you do an M2 it's like an advanced M2 case you do an M2 a sexy move M prime and then this cancel at the end here to here you do an L move and now this is here so this is like a case for there And there are alternatives, but I think this is a pretty good option. This one, here to here, you just do an M setup, and then it's 5 mover. We're actually set up to that in one of the other ones. This is an R prime into that, which means you're just doing R wide to the same 5 mover. Here to here, we do R prime FR into this, and then. Sorry cancel at the end so sorry I messed up a bit like that and then this is pretty cool we do an R into um, this case I showed before and we do the M at the same time sorry it's like this And I just think that's a fun one to execute, and I've messed up, but oh well. This is literally just a lefty version of an OLL to um, here. Here you do U prime L wide like that, and then you set up to a 5 mover, so it goes like this. Here you up on FR and then it's a five mover like that. Here you do an M again, and then this turns into an L, L wide move at the end. So all but one of these cases set up into this one, which is to there. So I'll just show you that first. It's just eight mover like that. So for this case in this case I'd recommend setting up to it so here just a D move like that and here different D move so it's up to it like that however here is a D2 and I don't think that's good so it's a do an L wide move and um, so if we look at it here the pieces are here well here and so that means we got pretty easy com like that So yeah. Okay, so for this sticker, for both of these cases, I rotate to that angle. So I just do the easy comms. For the F base, uh, here to here, it's just an eight move with an E interchange. And then for this one, you do like 
to here, you just do M2 and tap like that, M, undo, M. And it's actually quite tricky. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to reorient this by doing that. So what we're doing is here to here. So I'll reorient it and keep track of it, it goes there. And then here we can do an R wide move. So that is the fastest in my opinion. The other option is to do that as a mirror of a different one. But I think that's pretty inconsistent and easy to mess up. Here to here, it's just a 9 move E thing, so the easy. Um, here to here, there are a few ways. Um, I think the easiest way is just doing an S move like that, and that's what I do. But another thing you can do is an M move into this. But I don't even know if that's as fast. So I'd say go with this one's a pretty safe bet. And then this, you can either rotate and do a U-perm. But I don't recommend that. I recommend doing these two moves at the same time. It, and it's a five mover, but like on this layer. And I've done that the wrong around, so it goes R prime, R like that. Right. For here to here, this is a pure com. And this goes for most of the pieces on this sticker, so keep that in mind. Here to here, you can insert into the back. I think that's kind of awkward, so I'll just do it like this. Pretty easy. Here, this is another tricky one. You um, do a U-prime to put the buffer over here, and then bring this up into the top layer, and then you can do the insertion like that, and again, cancel into an R-wide move like that. Here to here, just do an R2 to make this interchange, and it's going to cancel at the end like that. For here, you do an R2F into a four mover. And then here, there's two ways you can do an R to do this, or you can do this and then do an RE thing. I personally just prefer doing this. Here, you just do an M to an M2 case, so it's just M, then solve this, and then you just cancel with an M at the end. And this is kind of tricky. You're going to do a U and an E at the same time, to that to a 5 mover, like this. But it's actually very fast when you practice it. Now for this sticker, uh, again, I do use for this face just inserts like that. So for this piece and this piece here, I'll just do a D move to set up to there, and I can do like this eight mover or the mirror, this eight mover, and then when I get this case, I'll just do a U and I have this interchange, so I do this. So here to here, you do an, uh, it's like the mirror of a case I already showed, but you can cancel in at uh, this end instead of at the end, so it goes. For here to here, just do an S move to put it here, and then it's just this eight mover. This is similar to the one I just showed, but um, and you cancel at the start as well, but it's on R, and for the S move, you're doing it this way instead of this way, so it's really similar to another one. Just make sure your S move is bringing the D layer onto this face at the beginning. But otherwise, it's pretty much the same. Then here, do an S move, and then easy A mover. Okay, so for this one, you could just do this eight mover like that, but it's actually more finger trick friendly to do this insert as four moves like that, and then you cancel at the end. And then for this, it's another case of just setting up to there. And if you can get this kind of stuff down when you learn this piece, it'll be really easy. 
So this is actually just MDN prime D twice. So that's pretty easy. It sounds bad, but it's honestly optimal. And then, so this again, pretty easy. So here to here, you could do like M prime, but I think it's better to do like an R wide prime U into this S four mover. Then here to here, the insertion is like that, but I prefer I then change it so you finger trick it as like R wide prime and D prime R wide like that. And then here to here, you can rotate, um, or you can like do these two moves at the same time. So that's up to an M2 case either way. Onto this sticker now here. So here, there to there is an R2 to make the interchange, and it's going to cancel at the end. Like that. Here, it's another advanced M2 to go to there. Insert M prime no M undo M and then here you can do with I'd personally recommend just getting good at this pure L U E but if you don't like L U E kind of stuff most of the time you can do just E2 and insert like that. Okay, so here to here. I'm going to do just an L wide prime, so that brings it up there, sets it up to a 5 mover. Pretty easy. Here, you set up to a 4 mover and 1 move like that, and you shoot R2, E prime, R2, E, like that. Pretty easy. Here to here, you shoot an S move, and then it's just an 8 mover like this. And here to here is a pure column, you just do E2. R wide U R prime, pretty easy. So this is for this sticker. So it's just easy eight mover. And then here to here, I personally just rotate like this and bring this down, and then I do the eight mover and cancel into an L two at the end. But there were lots of other things like you can do like a D two into this. You can look at other people's lists, I just don't really like any of them. And then here to here is just ED8 mover. Here to here, you, I like to just do U wide R prime and then it sets up to a 5 mover. Uh, there's other stuff, that's just what I use. And then here to here, it's pretty fast, you just do a U wide and then it's a 5 mover. So it goes like. Uh, now here to here, again it's just an M to like an M2 case, these are pretty easy to figure out. And then similar deal for this, you just do a U wide move and then do this 5 mover instead. Here to here, it's just an easy 8 mover, interchange as an M move, pretty easy to do. And then here to here to here, you insert in, you just insert this piece into the back, and you get this E4 mover, and then you can cancel this ending R2 into this. So here, uh, this is a bit of a tricky one, it's not that fast. You do an R prime, and that puts that down here, and the other piece here. And then you do a U prime and an E prime at the same time. And then it's just another R afterwards. Well, this sets up to the 5 mover, so it's 4 moves set up like that to a 4 mover. So it's. I like doing it and it's very fun to execute. Mm, but it's hard to get a hang of. <laughs> Hold a bit. Here to here. Easy 8 mover, should be able to figure that out. And then here, um, set to a case I just showed you with that. Okay, 
Um, so to here, it's just m into n prime undo. Here to here is just r u prime r prime e2, so pretty easy. This one, you do a u2 to put this over here, so it's interchangeable with down here. Then you do an m, insert, m prime, and then cancel undoing the insertion into that at the end. And then here to here, just do a u and get this 5 mover. Okay, so this one's where um, that little thing I showed you at the start, this thing, is useful. Because you can do an R set up to that, but it starts with R2, so it's just like this. So it's just like cancelling into that, and it's very fast. So I'd definitely use that. Um, here, here, here. I do like a... A U and a D prime at the same time, and then an R. So I do it like that, and then you got a five mover. Here, you've just got a little M two pure com here, and then here to here, you do a U, and you got a five mover like this. Okay, so this is going to be a pretty easy set to understand because it's just FD. It's interchangeable with the buffer with an M prime, so these are going to be pretty simple. So, for example, this case is just... So this one, um, it's just instead of... Well, yeah, okay. So it's going to be sexy move. It's going to be an M prime to get um, a different case. It's going to, if we track the pieces... So we got here, here, here. So if we track it, the comms like here, and we know this com. Well, I haven't showed it yet, but it's just that. And we're going to cancel properly, so it's going to go like this. So it starts like this, and instead of doing that, do that, and then do an R move and bring them both down like that. And then here, and this goes for most pieces, like at these outer R and L faces, just do like an M, insert, M prime, undo, M2. And then when it's um, this piece second, you do like that. So that's an easy way you can figure them out. And then here, this is a mirror of a different one. Just do a U, like that. It's pretty simple, just turn into an RFS. So I do you that, and then this should be able to figure out yourself, just easy, like that. So here to here, you can do M, or you could do like L, it's up to you, they're both pretty easy. Here to here, there's lots of things, you can do this kind of thing, which is probably fastest, but another thing you can do is something like Meet up, yeah. So U wide R, and then there's this interchange. So that works. For here to here, um, you just do a U prime, and then you got this S interchange. So you can do U prime S, and then the in insertion is R prime F two R, and this is really fun to execute. Well, more the inverse is fun to execute, but this is pretty fast too. And, oops, um, this is just a pure com, which you can do like that, or like that, to you. So for this case, and for this case, I'll do an S move setup into one of these eight movers. But for this case, I just rotate and do the pure com. Okay, here to here. This isn't OLL, honestly, it's just that. So, nothing to worry about there. Here to here. Again, you could do like that, or I'd recommend this because it's fastest. Um, here to here, you can do just that, and then you get a five mover. It's pretty fast. And then there's actually quite a fun one too. 
here to here, you do a U R Y prime into this five mover. Pretty easy, pretty good. And the last thing I'm going to say, you can set up to um, this for a lot of them. So D move, so you can get that one, that one by setting up like there. But I would do for this case, I would do L wide, and you finger trick it a bit like an A perm, and it's pretty fast. Okay, so for both this case and for this case, I like to just rotate here and do the simple interchanges. Uh, so if you don't like that, find a different algorithm if you don't. For here to here, simple eight mover, and you're probably realizing that these are a lot of simple eight or nine movers for this sticker now. Here, um, you can do the pure com. I don't like it. I do just an E to that. And then here, I rotate for this one. I do R prime, insert here, like that. For here to here, I do a pretty similar thing to I've shown you already, just U wide R into a five mover. For here, um, this is also similar to something I've already shown. You can do a U wide to put that there, and then it's a five mover like that. So yeah. Here, um, you should be figuring out how these work as well, just the M2 and M2 one. So when it's an outer target, you can do M2 and M2 case. Sorry, when it's, yeah, one of these. And when it's one of these targets on these, um, you can do them as M2 pure. There is better ways. I've literally just realized some cases I didn't mention. Uh, <laughs> This one, you can do that, or you can do two moves like that into a five mover, which might be faster, who knows. Uh, for here to here, so you point to a um, five mover, pretty fast. Um, here to here, it's D prime into that same thing, so you get... Or you can do it as an M2 pure as I just sent. And then for here, it's not great. I do a mirror of one of the ones I showed for this sticker. Uh, yeah, sorry for forgetting that. Anyway, back to this. Um, I've always done U wide R, but it's probably better just to do that. So just U wide into this five mirror. <laughs> I don't know why I don't do it. And then for this, I still use that. And, God, I'm getting close to the end of this now, aren't I? So for this case, again, I do a four move insert to make it more finger tricky. For here to here, instead of doing a D move, I think it's a bit nicer to do R prime. It sets you up to do this case pretty nicely, and especially the inverse, but that's pretty pretty quick. Uh, you can do this as M D prime, M prime, D prime twice, but I don't like that. I can't do it fast, so I just do S into this case there. But I don't know, one's optimal, my one's not. And it's a little bit slow, but to there, just D prime like that. May as well do it. To there, um, I do um, these two moves at the same time. Insert down like that. Don't know why I decided to show that one first. But then all we've got left is this one, which I've already showed the mirror of, it's just that. So pretty fast, just two moves like that. And then this is a bit harder to finger trick for me for some reason, but it's pretty optimal. Oh, pure com like that. Here to here, the A mover. Really don't really need to show these much anymore. I know a few ways of doing this, but the fastest is probably to here just L2 into that, cancel at the end, pretty similar to some other ones. Here to here, just rotate. Pretty similar to some other ones I showed, just like that. And here you can do like this with the R wide moves, or if you don't like that, just this. 
insert in the back like that. So for here to here, it's just R two F, and we get this four mover like this. Uh, shown a similar one already. Here to here, like this. So it's just an E move to a case I showed a minute ago, which is here, which is here to here. And that's a pretty fast alg. Then to here, pretty standard stuff with the nine mover. I explained how they work already. And then I kind of half rotate because you can do F and insert like that. If you don't like that, you can do an L move. And then just do like that. I don't know, it's up to you. So we're at this sticker now. But you've probably figured out how they work at this point. So I'll just show a few off. We got here to here, so we'll insert like that. And you insert to this spot if they're on the outer like this. If they're on the inside, you insert back there. So if it's here to here, for example, you do M prime like that. However, you do the interchange second if it's going to one of these ones. So you can put it there, insert the piece. Hopefully that makes some kind of sense. Uh, so that being said, um, this one here is a pretty similar one. It's just the mirror. Uh, the only ones you'll have to really think about is... Um, set out wrong. Uh, there, so they're there. Um, you can do just a U move. And then it's like with a B move I'm inserting it here. It's pretty fast. You can think of it as a bit of a rotation, honestly. It's still fast. And that goes for the same for this sticker. Like that. And then for here to here, like that. So that sets up to an RFS thing. Or if you do the U the other way, you set up to this, which is a different RFS thing. Uh, and then last things you really need to think about are these ones. Where you can do a four move insert again, but not that one. You instead are insert into the back there, so you go like that. And again, you do cancel a move out of it. So here to here, I do an L into this K. And then I cancel at the end like this. And then for here to here, I just do R2 into that and cancel at the end. Okay, so for here to here, just do like a U prime L into a five mover. For here to here, five mover setups, just one move like that. It's a pretty easy one. Here to here, I don't think the um, MT pure is that good. So instead, I'll just do a D prime into that case I just showed you. So it's these two moves at the same time. Pretty fast. And then here to here, I like to do L wide into that. So most of these are mirrors of that. So we got that one. Uh, here to here. Um, for this one, I think I can do the M2 pure faster. Test them both out. But this one, uh, like for example this, this is definitely optimal to just set to a far mover like that. Here, I imagine this is just, um, <laughs> I know this is probably not even the best. And I will show you an alternate, but you can do like this with the R2 already done. Another thing you do is um, something like this. So you can do an R prime to put that there and use this F interchange like this. And that's especially cool for this next one, 
because here you can do D into this. <laughs> so that's cool. And then the last one's uh, here. You can do it with D moves. I think the best way to do it is just U prime, and then it's this four mover. Pretty easy. So it's just going this, that. And you just make sure you get it the right way around. And that leaves us with one com, and that's here to here, and it's inverse. So we're just doing this move, and as I showed before, you can set up to a four mover, which is better than the M2 pure, because the M2 pure for this is quite pretty bad. So we do that, these two moves, and we get our last com. Okay, and that was full three star edges in one video. Jesus Christ, I shouldn't have made that. Okay, hopefully that helps uh, show how easy knowing full three style is, if I can fit it into one 40 minute video.